Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here, back again in Ark Survival Evolved on the Pooping Evolved server here again with Blood Eagle. What's going on, Blood Eagle? Hey, how you doing? I'm good, and today we are going to do something kind of fun and kind of cool. Um, I need to set up a little bit of a breeding area, not only because, you know, that's just something that's got to happen, but I have a very special egg here. It is a gray and blue egg. Have you seen this egg yet? I have not. It's very pretty. It's very pretty. Oh my pretty. god. It the is icon the... for it is just looking fabulous. Yeah, it is it looks a like an alien egg. Giganotosaurus egg. And if we if we check this puppy out, I should not have put that on my hot bar, but if we check this puppy out, it is actually huge. Like Oh my god. Yeah, that's bigger than us. So um, we're gonna actually just leave this in the AC just for now. Uh, in the fridge, you know, hopefully it doesn't become unfertile or anything like that. But, um, yeah, that's what we're going to do today. We're actually working towards getting some AC units. I want about eight. Um, I know that's probably a little overkill, but that's what I want. So we've got about four, uh, about, uh, what I say, about 350 metal. And I've got all kinds of metal being cooked up over here as well. So uh, we're going to possibly have two Giganotosaurus before the day is over. What do you think about that? Oh my god, I can't wait. Do you do you amazing. want do you want this one if I if I <gasps> Can I? You can. I'm gonna name him Fluffy. Fluffy. Uh Fluffy. For those of you that don't know, our Giganotosaurus is over here. Um it is, I, I actually like the way to say that Giganotosaurus. It's kinda of fun. I know everybody's been calling it uh, Giganto or Giganato or whatever, but Giganotosaurus is it's kinda of fun. But if we check him out, he's over here. Big boy. Killed me a couple more times today. Um, only about seven. You know, I had a, a pretty pretty bad day hey, with him. Hey, looked at me! Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, he's up to 44. Uh, I've got his stamina. The stamina is literally the only thing I've pushed on this guy. Uh, and I've only got him up to 552, which is still not very good. But uh, yeah, we're still working towards that, so... We're going to come back here in a few moments whenever we get all of the metal necessary for the ACs and uh, start building up a little uh, little spot to put his baby. Sound good? Uh, sounds like a plan. Uh, sounds like you're going to get spit at oh, by a no. Dilo. <laughs> I heard him spit at me. <laughs> <laughs> he missed. Bye bye. <laughs> Lock you out. Oh, uh, one more thing. Uh, the uh, Giganotosaurus uh, female that we got is actually Softest and Whippets. Uh, I met up with those guys earlier today in a live stream, and uh, we we had them do the do the deed. And uh, yeah, he gave me the egg. So, all right, we'll be back in just a hot minute. All right, guys. Well, we're building a little bit of a house here uh, just because I, I really didn't have much of anything but that little shack. So kind of tore down the little shack and we're building up here. Um, Blood's helping me out by building some walls and stuff. And I wanted to come back here, uh, try and get on top of this uh, this rock formation. Let's see if I can do it. Oh, I can. Yes. Um, and this is where I want to put the AC because um, I am going to put these inside. And if I can get this, oh, I can get one of them to work, not the other one. Well, I'll put the other one up over there. But this is where I can throw my AC. It'll actually be outside, so, you know, a little out of the way. Um, but I am just going to turn this off and turn it back on again. Or wait, can you... Blood, do you know if you can uh, pin pad generators? Um, I'm not sure. It doesn't look like you can. Okay, well, that might be a horrible idea. Um, okay, well, there goes that. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, yeah, I just put in two two big old doors. That way, you know, I can park some of the the dinos in here, or you know, the babies can get in and out uh, as they or as I need them to. But yeah, all right. Well, we're gonna come back here um, once we get enough for the ACs and uh, get everything built and ready to put up. Um, can you jump back? Holy <laughs> crap! <laughs> <laughs> That is, like, really cool Pretty looking strong. from down here. All right, guys. Well, we are back, and uh, Blood's having some fun on the toad. Do it again. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm going to craft up some of the AC units now. Uh, I've got uh, enough to make eight of them, which is actually going to be exactly what we needed. You know, you'd think that I was 
prepared for this sort of thing or something, but who knows, right? Uh, I'm gonna have to craft 10 more electronics to make the generator. And then, from there, electrical um, probably will just run probably just a vertical. I'll probably just make one vertical and then get this guy, so I'll need 30 electronics on top of the amount that I had. So I thought I had enough electronics, but I did not. So there's all the AC units. We've got all of those. They're surprisingly... You, you know how much thir or eight, uh, eight uh, air conditioners weigh, Blood? Too much. Actually, 30. probably only 30. 32, uh, to be precise. That's not a whole lot. Not a lot, considering how much, you know, metal weighs and everything, and then you cut that down and everything. Right. And then, uh, let's see, I had something somewhere. I thought I made... All right, am I losing my mind here? Like saying a thousand bricks. Here's a thousand bricks weighing like a bajillion pounds, but you know you turn it into a house. Now it weighs only ten pounds. Right. I I am losing my mind, blood. Um, I had a bunch of catwalks made up. Uh, they're in one of the um. Oh, I'm not gonna make that one. I didn't have a running start. Oh, never mind. <laughs> um, they were in the vault. Uh, next last time I saw. I was looking for him. I, I must have misplaced him. Unless I put him on my Quetzal. There they are. Found him. All right. So um, I was going to take these catwalks. And if you want to come in and check this out, you're more than welcome to. All right. I'm going to jump right in. Whee! Jump right in. You did not quite make the jump. Well, it, 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 it was hard <laughs> dangling that. So what I'm thinking is, you know, I want to have floor space open to lay the eggs, right? So I'm thinking that if I take catwalks like this and I can place the AC units on top of them, what do you think about that? Kind of interesting, you know, it kind of like brings them off the ground so they don't get dusty or dirty or anything. Right, and can I, is this guy going to fit in there? Nope. <laughs> no, not from my point of view. Nope, nope, definitely not. Um, well. You call me fat, you call me fat, I, I did, I called him fat. Let's see, maybe I can get on top of Jane here. Oh, Jane's got a level up. I can suck it in. All right, now if I close these doors and I hit seven. Nope, still doesn't go on top for some reason. All right, maybe it's just because I'm on the dino. Happens if I'm standing under it. Uh, I gotta get, I gotta get lifted. Like I gotta get a little elevated up there. Get here, lifted. jump and I'll, I'll push you up onto it. Oh Ready? yeah, good point. Uh, Ready? Huh. Have to. That did not work at all. Huh. That did not work at all. Huh. That actually worked great. Thank you. Yay! <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna try this. I'm gonna put it as close to the wall as I can. There we go. Alright. Nice. And it's foggy. Yeah, it's actually very foggy. It's a good thing we're doing this inside. Kinda. Like I walk over in this corner, I can not, I can't see you anymore. Is it that foggy for you? Not that foggy. It's you know just. It's spooky. annoying. All right, so there are seven of the um, eight, and I guess if I put two more up here, they should still reach. I would assume because they have a two-block radius, and so I assume two blocks is going to be down as well. So there's our AC walls. Um, let me go grab the generator and stuff. Real the wall of ACs. It is actually incredibly foggy, and I can't see anything. Ali, yoop! Did you see the way I did that? It was kind of amazing. <laughs> All right, structures, electrical. Uh, oh wait, uh, what happened? Why did my generator crash? Oh, because I didn't actually. Finish the crafting. That's smart on my part. All right, so we get those there. I'm going to turn that off because it is incredibly loud. And I still, I can't see anything. So we're all doing this by, uh, by whatever you call that stuff. By feel. All right, so there we go. Seven. I want my generator to go this way. 
Oh god, I'm stuck. Oh god, blood help. Are you stuck? I've trapped myself in in the Hey. Trapping yourself. Oh no, I got up. No mind. <laughs> what you doing, Drax? Okay, that is crazy. Then, that alright, it should have connected to all of them, which is actually really good. Let's see, everything yep, they've all got connections. Just like, you know, we do. We have connections. You know that? We have connections. We have connections. Uh, now, our AC, but I can't tell you. AC units... No, they're not pin paddable either, which is really unfortunate. Like, I don't know why they don't do that. They do them for everything else that's electronic, but... All right. So here's the moment of truth, blood. I'm going to get the egg, and we're going to stick it in there, and we're going to turn all those AC units on. And do you think it's going to work? No. You don't Actually, think it's probably. Work. I think it'll work. All right. Well, we'll see here. Let's check it out. Where'd you go? I, I It was foggy, and I brought in Jurassic Arc, and I was going to scare you. Oh, okay, okay. You then, trying and to... Then, and then I got blocked by... Uh, Everything? By, by your Indominuses. <laughs> <laughs> They're just like, I'm going to look up and stop you. So, your level 153 is smelling my butt right now. <laughs> All right, I've turned on the generator. I probably should put a door right there as well to kind of make it easier to uh, get in there. But I'm going to drop the egg here. Drop. All right. Oh, it's incubating. Awesome. It's incubating. Yay. It, and it's actually 70 degrees here, so I have no idea what the temperature is. But um, I think when I threw the egg down earlier, it said it was too cold. So... This egg is actually too tall to go underneath the first shelf. Really? Yeah, it's it's that big. Like, I can see the glow already. <laughs> yeah, see, it's it's just way too big to go under that shelf, which oh, I did oh not expect. God. I would I would have put up put it up higher if that was a thing. But all right, well I guess we just gotta wait for it to incubate. It's gonna it's gonna be a while, so we'll uh, we'll be back when it's close. If it doesn't spoil first. All right, guys. Well, we are waiting on the egg to finish incubating. And so I am on meat duty. Blood's watching the egg like a good mama. And uh, I am <laughs> <laughs> I am out here just uh, on my skeletal T-Rex. This guy's actually really cool looking. I'm glad I got him. Ooh, that was a 96 packy. That's the only bad thing about, like, doing uh, a ton of meat gathering is I don't pay attention to the levels of stuff that I'm attacking. And I kill, like, really high level. Like, I killed a 108 raptor earlier. Like, that kind of hurt a little bit because I like raptors so much. Yeah, but, when I, uh, when we were getting meat for the Giganto, I'm just going to call it the Giganto because that's easy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Good haters. But when we were getting meat, I had actually uh, killed a level 120 T-Rex. Yeah. And I know Whip it was like sad about that because I, I told I told them in chat, and uh, he was like, "Where is it?" And I'm like, "I killed it." He was like, "Aww." <laughs> but, and that's funny too. Like I killed like two 120 sabers the other day, and like didn't even bat an eye. Like it was within 20 minutes of each other. It's just some, you know, when you're not looking for these things, you don't pay attention, and it sucks. But I'm not gonna check the level of every single dino that I go up to kill because I'm yeah. gonna be killing a lot. So pretty much. All right, so we're gonna fill up these troughs. Uh, I made four of them, put them in the the house with them, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll uh, fill them up and bring you back when the baby's done incubating. All right, guys. Well, we have mere seconds left before we see this thing hatch. Uh, I'm pretty excited. It keeps ticking down a little bit. I'm going to actually open the door. Uh, well, I guess these open, doors only open, open door. inward. Never mind. Um, but, yeah, if we keep oh, watching we here. Go. Let's see. Let's watch it tick again. Oh, it's so close. It is so super close to be able to see this baby hatch. And it's going to be like, I imagine it's going to be raptor size by the time it comes out. Uh, you ready to imprint? We, we need warm towels and water. <laughs> are, you, are you ready? You got meat on you so you can put it on them? Uh, uh, yep. 
All right, here it, it should be coming. Any, I would assume, any second now. Be any able to second. The uh, Giganotosaurus. Giganotosaurus. All right, come on. Hatch, dang you, hatch. Oh my god, it's huge! Oh my god! Oh! oh. Imprinted. It's kind of adorable, uh, actually. Um, it only wow. Needs five meters a second. It's right. only level six. Holy mackerel. Oh, yeah, I mean, I guess the other two were level fours. Um, and then they had their, their taming thing, but. This guy is actually huge. Like, like, let me go get a raptor. Or like, <laughs> hold on. Uh, raptor. I guess I'll get one with its skin. That way, you know, we can actually get a cool comparison here. Like, no joke. This baby, it's bigger than a raptor. Holy cow. Do you see he this? He's a big baby. No, oh, he's on wonder. What you doing? Oh, you know what? Here, I can, uh, I can do this here. Have him follow momentum, and that way he won't ever really move around too much. But yeah, I can't believe how big it is. I really can't. Let's back it I, up. I just want, I just, yeah, I just want to, if you can get him out of the corner while I feed him. Trying to. Let me know when he moves. He's... Looks like you could ride him while he's just this big. He, he does. It does. It looks like you could like saddle oh, him up and. Oh what? <laughs> um. Excuse me. <laughs> oh no 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 no! Don't unwhistle him. Oh he's. I uh, disabled wandering. I uh, I'm pretty sure that each level they hit, like if he goes from baby to juvenile, he'll enable wandering again. Oh. <laughs> He, uh, he just did some parkour stuff right there. <laughs> he did. That was crazy. But that is so cool. Like, this little guy is super, super cool. Now, if we take a look, he's still got 15, 115,000 health, 400 stamina. Um, pretty basic compared to what we had on the other guy. It's level 6, so you're going to get a few more levels out of him than we had. But, uh, I mean, he's he's big. Like, he's he's definitely bigger than a raptor, like, as a baby. Like, that's crazy. I'm so excited. How you do? What are oh you gonna name God. him, Blood? Um, I'm not sure. Why does it say Baby Giganta, uh, Giganta, or uh, Giganotosaurus repairing? Uh, do you see that? We broke him. <laughs> we broke him. I wonder. I wonder if we had him damaged, if he would turn rage mode. I don't I want really... to. I don't want to because he's a baby, you know. I don't want to hurt the baby, but I just, I'm curious. Uh, let's see what stuff do I have. Okay, I just have fur leggings and boots. No, don't do it. Not around my base. Well, no, no, no. I'm just, I'm just saying in case if he wants to rage mode yeah. on us. He's super cute. Like, super, he's, super adorable. He's adorable. I need to take a screenshot. You want, you want to get in there, father? Father Drax. Hi. Oh, he's trying to look at me. Oh, he's pushing me out of the way. Oh, you, oh cuddle up with him. That's kind of cute. He's like trying to, to cuddle up with his father. Oh, oh, that's so adorable. All it right, looks like he's just going to bite my hand off any second. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, man. You want a picture with the baby? You want a picture of me with the baby? Sure. There you go. Uh, Stick hey, your head in its me. mouth. <laughs> look at me. Look oh. at me. Why don't you love me? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. I uh, want to do a little test here real quick. Uh, let's see if we can get him to come outside. Come outside. Hey. I know you were born like an hour ago, but come outside. <laughs> <gasps> he's so adorable. All right, so there he's outside. Now, I don't think we're going to be able to pick him up with an RG, but there is a possibility that we could pick him up with a Quetzal. Um, let's see. I'm going to try it with an RG just to see. Nope. Nope. nope oh, he's, a, he's just too big of a baby. Okay, now get on my Quetzal. I'll probably get my unsaddled Quetzal. It might be a little easier to actually gather him up. Ooh, here's a Quetzal egg, too. Awesome. 
Wow, right. I parked I parked stupid pretzel over there and he's just making his magic work. He is just making magic. Alright, let's see. What do you think? You think this will be able to pick him up? I'm hoping. No, he's gonna be hard to bring over to my base. Oh, I picked up the mammoth. <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah, that is going to make it significantly more difficult to, to move. I, I knew you could pick up the, the Rexes in their baby state, but uh, it does not look like we're going to be able to move this guy. So, yeah, definitely just picked up the Mammoth again. That's the wrong big baby. It is the, very much the wrong big baby. I'm going to try one more time here. He's so adorable. You picked uh, up the worst big baby. <laughs> Just picked up the bloody baby. I mean, the what? The bloody baby. All right. That's a little weird. All right, guys. Well, you know, we're going to try and work this guy over to Blood's base. Um, or maybe leave him here for a little bit and let him get to at least a juvenile. At least have a little bit of weight on him. And, uh, yeah. So, hope you guys enjoyed today's episode of Ark Survival Evolved on the Pooping Evolved server. We made a baby Giganotosaurus. And uh, I think it's it's pretty darn cool. What about you, Blood? I love him. I, I love, love him. him. He's I amazing. Really him. But yeah, guys, you can check out Blood in the description down below. And uh, yeah, we'll be back uh, tomorrow. All right, guys. Have a good one.